Ooh, child, that was a beat. That's the WC here with a review of one of the most anticipated fights. Somebody's O has got to go. And not only did Spence's O go, Crawford, like, literally, he just, like, he took it from him. He threw it on the ground. He spit on it. Then he burned it. Then he put it out. And then he set it on fire again. That's what he did. Look at the copy box numbers, bro. Like, listen, the first round, Spence looked like he was game. You know what I'm saying? He was throwing. He was coming in. Crawford was being very, very patient, which he's, which he's known for doing. All right, one of the best counter punches in the, in the world right now. Pound for pound. Nobody measures up to him. All right? <laughs> it's just the way that it is. All right? Look at the accuracy of his jab. All right? One thing about the fight game that people have to understand is that the jab is the most important. Now, I'm not sure if Crawford is southpaw or not, but clearly his jab was like the story of this fight. It was just way too fast for Spence. Spence had no answer for his jab. And then later round, second round, I mean, he just started teeing off on him. He just saw a whole bunch of holes in Spence's gains. And he just he just wound up and he just started throwing haymakers out of nowhere. And when a counterfighter, a primary counter counterfighter, because that's what made Floyd Mayweather so great is his counter game and his defense led to his easy, easy offense. He would just wear people down with his defense. And Terrence Crawford is is he's like he's like Mayweather in that in that sense, but he has the knockout power. Like, no offense to Floyd. Floyd was a, de a decisionator. I don't care what nobody say. Crawford ain't going to no damn decision with you. He going to try to destroy you. Once he once he sees those holes, once his, once his jab gets through hard enough. And Spence, like, I mean, he put up a fight, but it wasn't, it just wasn't good enough. I mean, there was not enough power. There was not enough accuracy. There was just not enough. And when you're going against a guy like Crawford, Look at the look at the numbers. I'm gonna read it off to you guys, man. The jabs. He threw 206 jabs, laid it landed 86. His face was like Spence's his 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 lip was swollen, bro. His face was leaking, bro. The power punches. He threw 163. Landed 98. I mean, oh, I mean, it's just wow. Body shot. Well, the body shot Spence, like you see, like Spence in the first round threw a whole lot of stuff to the body. He tried to, you know, try to get Crawford off his game. But, man, whew, how many knockdowns? About four, maybe five knockdowns. I think I put a prop out there um, that I actually won that one where one of, either one of the fighters would be knocked down within the first six rounds. Cha-ching, right? So I cashed on that, but everything else is just... Whew, I thought I was going to go to a unanimous decision or majority unanimous decision for Crawford. Didn't get that far. You know, I wanted to give Spence at least a little bit of, you know, the credit because he has it all. Or he did have it all. But, man, just outclassed on so many different levels, man. It, it was just a, a, a complete beating. Let me know how you guys feel about this fight. Um, did you guys see it as being this lopsided, man? I mean, I just, I didn't necessarily see it being this long side. I mean, like I said, I did put in a majority decision bet for Crawford. That's bold for against somebody that's, you know, that's got to know. But Crawford definitely pound for pound. Um, one of the best in the world right now. Just pound for pound greatest right now. Uh, let me know how you guys feel about this fight. This was the Spence versus Crawford review. Let me know how you guys feel down below. What do you think is next for Terrence Crawford? And do you think that Earl Spence can recover from this? Like, when fighters lose their O's, man, it's like it changes them forever, man. It it, it it changes them. Sometimes it makes them into a better fighter, and then sometimes they're just never the same guy or girl. Okay? Make sure I put that in there. It's the WC with the fight review, man. Make, look, make sure that you drop a like and share it with your people. I don't drop videos like this all the time, man. It's like a special guest star appearance for me, all right, coming out here and doing this. You know, one of the things that's going to get me to do this is an undefeated fight, and you got your money's worth. If you want to see somebody get their ass whipped, you do. <laughs>
You definitely saw it in this fight, man. It's the WC. And until next time, peace out. Whew, look at those jab numbers, man. Look at the jab numbers. One more time before I go. Whew, my face hurt.